Welcome back to the channel. Make sure you hit that subscribe button for more sports content from, as you could tell, soccer in England, in the Premier League, to basketball, the NBA, the MLB, the NHL. We do it all here on this channel. Uh, today, we had a game that was postponed. That was Burnley and Watford. Uh, the only game on TV today was Brighton and Chelsea, and Chelsea you know, fell into the third spot with that loss to uh, Man City the other day and with Liverpool winning the other day, fell from second to third. So there was a third, I believe a 13-point gap. Yeah, a 13-point gap. So Chelsea really needed this to jump over Liverpool, get back into second place, and cut that gap into 10 points. Well, it was looking all good because in... Because in the 28th minute, Zayac scored to make give Chelsea the lead 1-0. And it was pretty back and forth game. The shots were 10-15 to at the end of the game in favor of Chelsea. Uh, corners are 7-5 to in favor of uh, Chelsea. Uh, fouls, there were 5 on Chelsea, 8 on Brighton. And then 2 yellow cards for Chelsea, the 1 on Brighton. Uh... You know, that's Zayic's third goal of the season. Uh, I was expecting more from him this season so far. But, you know, that could change my mind eventually on him. He has three goals now with two assists in the Premier League this season. But in the 60th minute, Adam Webster from Brighton's team there scores to make it 1-1. That is actually Webster's first goal of the season for him so ultimately end of the game 1-1 Chelsea couldn't hold on or score anymore to give them that cushion to get back into the race with Man City getting a point does help but the three points would have helped a lot more as for Brighton they are sitting ninth they were sitting ninth I could go check what they're sitting at now in the standings, they are still in ninth place, right behind the Wanderers. So it was a good game in general, like fast pace, you know, a lot of shot attempts, not a lot that actually hit the net, just a lot of shot attempts. But for Man City, this kind of gives them more breathing room in a sense too, with knowing Chelsea tied with a ninth place team, which it should have been a game they won. No disregard to Brighton fans out there it's a game Chelsea had in the bag they have better players they should have won this game easily but that's the life of playing football or soccer where I'm from it's the odds aren't always in your favor when it comes to it but that's the video a quick video a quick update that Chelsea can't gain ground on Man City. Webster put that dream away with the tie in goal. I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I do have more Premier League stuff coming. I believe tomorrow there is a couple games. Yeah, we got Brentford and Manchester United, Tottenham and Leicester City. Two huge games there. Uh, points race wise and everything so I hope you guys have a great rest of your day I'll catch you on the next one